In this tutorial, we're going to talk about the angular mid. We said in the previous tutorial that this part is not rotating like this in the real world. So we will try to apply some angular mid to limit this angle. So we can give a specific angle to rotate and here also as you notice this one also needs some angular mates so let's start apply the angular mate on the button and the connector here so we can find two planes that can be part each other and can apply the angular mate so let's find the first part here the bottom part is this one so we can try to find the right plane and then go to the mid advanced mid you will find the angular limits here so we we'll try find the second part the connector right plane as well or the plane which is parallel to this in this case right plane as well so we have these two planes and you can imagine these two planes can rotating in a limited angle so let's make a default angle 30 and make here 50 and minus 50 okay so let's try now to rotate this part now you notice you we limited the movement of this part so it is more realistic right now now let's apply it to the connector and the top part with the same idea find the planes or rotating planes so in this case here we have one plane for the connector then we have it selected here and then we go to the third part find the angular plane so these two planes have to be limited with an angle and again activate the angular we make it 30 so as you notice we have to reverse the direction 50 and minus 50 okay you are done okay so now you notice that we limited the movement or the angular movement of these parts it's more realistic and nice to work with